Thanks for making your way to WTHITV.com. I'm Storm Team 10 meteorologist Matt Brooks, and we are tracking quite a bit of rain in the weather department on the Storm Team 10 Futurecast. This is midnight here. We're tracking some widespread rain showers for tomorrow morning. A little more widespread than Futurecast is painting a picture of here. But I think it does a pretty good job once we get into the midday hours and afternoon. Widespread heavy rain, even some thunder showers making its way into the mix here. You can see that by the yellows and oranges starting to pop up. I don't think we'll have any severe weather, but the winds will be pretty gusty and we'll keep an eye on that for you as we go about the day. For tomorrow night, we'll have some lingering rain showers, but things should start to wrap up as we get into Tuesday morning. For Tuesday, I don't think we're going to go quite so clear. I believe with all the moisture, we'll have at least a partly cloudy day. Now, as far as rain totals are concerned, through Monday night and into early Tuesday morning, could be looking at around two inches of rain in some spots. That's enough to lead to some minor flooding on the roadways and certainly some flooding in low-lying areas, so just be on the lookout for that. Tonight and into tomorrow morning, temperatures stay pretty mild. We're in the low 40s. Wind speeds start to pick up, though, out of the south, 15 to 25 miles per hour. Gusts around 30, I would make sure you weight down all the trash bins. You don't want those blown over. For tomorrow night, lingering rain showers, temperatures in the mid-40s. We stay pretty mild through all this rainfall. In your Storm Team 10 seven-day forecast, 56 for a high Tuesday, 51 on Wednesday. Wednesday afternoon, we might have a few sprinkles, but most of us are going to stay dry. Thursday, the cool air catches up with us, 44 for a high, 43 on Friday. 42 Saturday, we warm up a little for Sunday with a high of 46. Thank you for visiting WTHITV.com. Stay dry out there.